In this video I'm going to go over how to add your dedicated server to farmsimgame.com. It's actually quite simple. Uh, if you have Discord you can easily just log in with Discord or you can register um, a new account. Either or works fine. Uh, I'm going to log in. I've already got an account set up. Once logged in, uh, you go to your dedicated servers link here, and then over here uh, in the sidebar we have add server, and uh, we'll just click that, and then just fill this out with your information about your dedicated server. Uh, just be uh, somewhat detailed, because uh, this is what others are going to see uh, to know what kind of server you have and uh, be able to uh, decide which server is best for them and uh, so we'll just go with uh, test server and if you've got a, a website for your um, server you can put that here and you want to give it a nice little description and you can kind of add some flavor to it with the uh, BB code links that are up here so for example uh, this is my server and it is awesome so let's say I want to make that bold or uh, let's make server another color uh, this one right here now you just set the color here so we could go with green or blue, yellow, you know, just pick a color. I'm just going to put red. Uh, what uh, version of Farming Simulator the server is. And then what type of server it is. So, for instance, uh, farm, just a farming server, you can just click that. Uh, logging server, you know, just anything that yours is related to. Uh, the ones that you'd like and that's so that when people are looking for servers they can click like locking servers and yours would show up under logging if it's a logging server and so on um, the link XML this is needed um, if you want uh, farmsimgame.com to keep track of your server stats and uh, the bot can also um, display those stats in your discord server if the bot is a member of your server uh, to get this link uh, open up your dedicated server website and log in and then if you go to settings you'll have these links down here and this one right here link at link xml copy that now, as you can see here, this one's showing a local address, so make sure you use your internet IP because uh, people outside your network won't be able to see this. So we'll copy that, put it here. Make sure you update your IP to your internet IP and forward it to port. And then um, your mods download link, if you use Google Drive or something like that, you can put that here. Um, or you can just come in here, click mods, and then copy this. In my case, I could change this one up here to farm sim game.com. Then your Discord invite link, uh, your website URL. That's not it. I think I got this one wrong. Oh, I did get this one wrong. <clears throat> this is actually for the bot for when it connects uh, or for the URL up here. So you would be able to customize it instead of it just being a, a number, uh, the ID or whatever. You can actually put, um, you know, like my. Let's do awesome. Do that there, and it does a check to make sure because we can't have duplicates. So 
make sure this is checked. Uh, and then you can upload an image, select an image. Uh, I'm not going to worry about doing it right now. And then you just submit it. And if you add an image, it'll take a moment to upload that image. Alright, it's been successfully added. Alright, so um, you can go back and edit your server information. So if something doesn't look right or your uh, map or XML, this data is not showing up properly, you can go back and edit it. Uh, you can also edit to add a new picture or update your current one. Edit server information, you can change any of that information here. Re upload <coughs> photos, whatever. Whatever you feel like you need to do here. Um, so we'll say go back to the dedicated servers. And of course, uh, in this page, it's it goes by the order that they are added to um, the website. And then we can do view server details. And it takes a moment sometimes on this. Because what it's doing is it's connecting to that dedicated server to get the most up-to-date information from it. Like uh, active users or anything like that. Um, and they can be voted on. Uh, and we'll have more in the future uh, to better sort the you know more popular servers. Uh, as you can see the server's red and it's bold for awesome. Got your links. Then you got the different gameplay types. And then these are the bot commands. If you have the bot in your Discord or you're on the Farm Sim Game Discord, you can use these commands to display your server information. See right there, it says awesome server. And up here, awesome server. So that's what that uh, URL name is for. It'll display your the players online, the players active the past week. It'll show the map with the locations of the different vehicles that are on there. And then users can comment and uh we do have plans to add a bunch more to it so you'll know, be looking forward to that uh, i'll go back and look at uh one of these other servers for example this one um it'll show the past week uh activity so you know how many hours each user was on throughout the whole day uh the map and all that good stuff and comments uh, pretty nice little setup uh, we do plan on adding a bunch more and improving anywhere we can and if you uh, if you really like this and use it you know make sure to join our discord um, the link is on the home page down here at the bottom right now there's two of them eventually it'll just be one uh, but join us on discord let it share your ideas with us and uh, we're happy to have you thanks for watching